Now it's on to Wilson High to check out the area's number one college recruit, Wilson linebacker and wide receiver Lawrence Timmons. Hard to believe as a freshman, he was admittedly a 140 pound weakling. Well, people said I couldn't do it. I was too puny. I was a I was a punk and all this good stuff, and I was like, I had my mindset that I was going to play football and be the best at it as I can. Now, Timmons stands six feet three inches tall and weighs 225 pounds. He brings thunder with his hits. Timmons is the area's second leading tackler with 139 for the season. I just think when you, like, when you first play a game, like if you got a real big, a real big good running back, just him the first time, you don't have to really worry about him no more. Teammate Andrew Gibson says there's one night he'll never forget. My um, sophomore year, played against Midland Valley in the um, second round of playoffs. We didn't need a big hit to come up. He got a big hit and man fumbled. We matched the third round. And that was one of my best moments with him. Knowing a smile, a smirk, you'll get a smirk from L Square. He's not really a joker joker, but he get the job done. Well, we started calling him L Square because when he was in the ninth grade, he used to play receiver with a cowboy collar when he was number 95. And he used to do all, do all kind of crazy stuff, you know what I'm saying? We used to be going halfway, and he was always going full speed, knocking people out. So we used to call him, start calling him L Square as he was kind of slow. Timmons carries a 3.2 GPA. Nearly every major school in the country has made offers. Well, I'm looking for how the coaches are, what's it like living around there, and just the college life. And I want to, my top five are Florida State, Florida, um, Tennessee, Michigan, and Maryland. Timmons says head coach Daryl Page taught him how to be a man. Former Zoneman finalist Justin Durant schooled him on how to play linebacker. Oh yes sir, he taught, he taught me how to use my hands and read, read the O-line and just, just play. Timmons also led the area with more than 800 receiving yards. He had five touchdown catches. While most schools are recruiting him as a linebacker, Michigan believes he'd make a great wide receiver. Coach Page discovered Timmons' greatness one fall afternoon more than two years ago. He was kind of having a lackluster practice, and uh, it was a um, defensive day, and um, I, I mean, I really chewed him from one end to the other. I, I just can't repeat what I said, but the next play, the intensity, the all the fire seemed like it came out of this guy. And I, right then and there, I knew he was special. Zoneman finalist Lawrence Timmons is headed to the Shrine Bowl. And in the closest balloting ever, the 2003 Zoneman winner is going to Wilson High School in Florence. Lawrence Timmons wins the 2003 Zoneman. Lawrence, congratulations, and uh, as someone who has seen this award show for the past three years, you kind of had an idea what the Zoman was all about. What does it mean for you to win this award? It means a lot. I had went through a lot of hard work, and I think I, I earned it. And I'd just like to say thank you to my coach and my parents and all my teammates.